Where has the time gone? But you guys are in my backpack now because we are heading out. Thanks for taking me to the airport jam. Welcome. Thanks for Boba Jam. Yes. <laughs> Two hours later. <laughs> Apparently this is famous on TikTok? Yes. Yeah? <laughs> she said everything is neatly placed and organized. <laughs> this is the most organized snacks, nuts, whatever I've ever seen. The next day. Welcome to my channel everyone. If you're new here, hi, I'm Anna, the face behind Girlboss Anna, which is a stationary business aimed to empower women and to inspire paper crafters to push the bounds of creativity through innovative products. Now that we've got introductions out of the way, let's get started! My tablecloth doesn't fit. No one has extra. We're gonna forego it. So I'm pretty sure you know the situation just by watching what you just watched. <laughs> I'm struggling over here. I'm like, do I keep setting up or do I try and look for a tablecloth somewhere? Like, can I pull a tablecloth out of my butt? Or like, do I gotta go to the nearest Target? Do they even have tablecloths there? That's all the stuff I was thinking while I was setting this up. I was like, hmm, if I can set this up and maybe if my friend comes and helps me, never mind. Nope, nope, nope. I looked at the time and I only had. 30 minutes left and I was like, your girl is just gonna forego this cloth right now. This is just not gonna work. So that's what I did, friends, and it all worked out. Mine was the only brown table at this vending event. <laughs> but you know what? Sometimes it just be like that. So I had my AirPods in just listening to music this whole time. What I've learned, this is only my second time vending by myself, but what I've learned from Better Together when I first vended by myself, man, that was hectic. But I learned that music while you're setting up is the best way to set up. I personally love to go for the minimalistic approach when it comes to setting up my vending booths, just because I feel like that's very Anna. Like I love minimalism, but being a minimalist does not mean that you have to be all monotone, white and black. I personally love color, so I love letting my products shine, and I think that it's very apparent in the way that I set up my booths, in my social media, my Instagram, my YouTube videos, even thumbnails, like it's very simple, but I honestly think that there is beauty. There truly is beauty in simplicity, friends. I should probably do a TED talk on beauty and simplicity. <laughs> like that could be a whole talk there. Anyways. Here I am setting up my fairy lights because I love letting, like I said, my products shine and I like adding a little touch of shine in my spreads as well. I think the best part is when you actually turn on the lights and then you see the final product and it just looks amazing. You see like you don't need too many things in your booth. Granted, if you want to go all out, please go for it. Like if that's your jam, please go for it. But for me, I just love letting my products be kind of like the main star of my spreads. So yeah, friends, third time vending, second time vending alone though. And I can say that it's it's not too hard if you just set up everything. Like I set up square, I packed all of my things into two luggages and I was able to travel with them. One was a carry-on and one was a check-in. I'm sure over time my tastes and my style will change, so will my spreads. But for now, this is what it is. And I hope that this kind of helps you to see how simple and easy it is to set up a vending booth. But please keep in mind that it was only easy because I prepped in advance. Don't be doing it last minute. Live your life within the moment, moment. And don't go wait until the morning, morning. Live your life within the moment, moment. And don't go wait until the morning, morning. You never know when it is over, over. All that I know is still get over. It's a video! So let us.
And just like that, plan to inspire SoCal 2022 just flew by and the next thing I knew I was on a plane back home. I had such an amazing time and loved connecting with new and old friends but alas I guess all good things have to come to an end. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you guys for tuning in. Remember new vlogs every Sunday here on this channel and make sure you give this video a like and also subscribe if you are interested in seeing more behind the scenes shenanigans like this. See you next time friends. Bye!